Hello, good evening. This is a quick video just to show how to check for constraints in a shadow in the Microsoft project. I got this email request on my blog from Ravi. He's like, can you please, can you post a video where a formula checks all the constraints in the shadow and if as soon as possible constraint is not used, then it will flag up. Is this possible? sure it's possible but for me using the formula for to do that it's an overkill so i'll keep it simple um, normally the easiest way to identify task with constraints in a schedule is just to look at um, the indicators um, column and if you see a calendar icon you know it's got a um, date constraint but the problem with this method is if a task has got as late as possible constraint, it doesn't show up here because it doesn't have a, an actual date. Um, like I know this task seven, task seven, it's got as late as possible constraint, same as task eight, but they both don't have the icon. Another way, which is what I would normally do, is to add the constraint type column to my table and then just filter like you do in Excel, just remove the as soon as possible constraint from the list and you should be left with, um, with the ones with the other type of constraints but if you don't want this either um what i'll do is if i go back the other way i'll say is set up a filter view filter new filter just call it i like numbering my filters so that they appear at the top Let's say constraints check and the field name is constraint um, type and all you want your filter to do if it's not equal to as soon as possible yep you save this if you come here, you see your constraint, your custom count and filter is there. So with this, anytime you want to check for check for constraints in the shadow that are not as soon as possible, you just click your filter, say constraint check, and it shows you. So you, you can actually hide this color. It does it. If you go back to your no filter, to check, you click on this. I mean, for this, this is simpler than using a formula. Well, thank you for watching. Have a good evening. Mm -hmm.